Good evening, I'm Jasper with your quick update on the latest news here in the UK and around the world. This week's edition of French satirical magazine Charlie Hebdo will show a cartoon depicting the Prophet Muhammad holding a Jusui Charlie sign. Above the cartoons are the words, all is forgiven. This comes after Islamist gunmen last week raided the magazine's Paris office, killing 12 people. In the UK, consumer price inflation fell sharply to 0.5% in December, down from 1% in November, the Office for National Statistics has said. December's rate is the joint lowest on record, easing pressure on the Bank of England to raise interest rates. More on the Air Asia flight, drivers in the Java Sea have retrieved the cockpit voice recorder from the crashed Air Asia flight QZ8501, say officials. The retrieval comes a day after the first piece of the so-called black box. The flight data recorder was also found and brought to shore. Back in the UK, the cost of creating places for the 880,000 extra pupils expected in England by 2023 could push schools to breaking point, council leaders warn. The local government association fears the demand for school places could soon reach a tipping point with no more space or money to extend schools. And now, 25 different cancer treatments will no longer be funded by the NHS in England, health chiefs have announced. NHS England announced the step after it emerged the £280 million cancer drugs fund for drugs not routinely available. Some drugs will be re removed and others restricted. A move charity say could leave some without crucial treatments. And that's all from me, so keep watching your favourite channel, the Sangat's channel, Sangat Television. Good night. Good evening, and now for the latest Sikh news. In Pakistan, a man suspected of murdering a Sikh Hakim in Rawalpindi is in police custody on a four-day remand. Manmohan Singh, who ran a herbal medicine clinic at Harun Chong in Sharikal, went missing on January the 3rd, and his father lodged a case with Sadiq Bad the police the same day. In the UK, Wakefield College's commercial training arm services to business have announced Carl Sucker as the recipient of this year's Employer of the Year Award at Glittery Awards ceremony last week. Carl Sucker, based in Pontefract, was set up in 2006 when it brought Vicarage Court Care Home, a 30-bed dementia care home in North Featherstone. They developed the care home, making it excellent rated. In Canada, members of a Sikh temple in Edmonton have been cleaning up after graffiti was painted on the walls of their building. Gurdwara Shri Guru Singh Sabha spokesperson Gurcharan Singh Sangha said they found the writing which included the words Leave Canada along with a racist remark. And Bhai Gurbak Singh Khalsa's press secretary Bhai Gurpreet Singh Guri has clarified that Bhai Khalsa was not willing to take medical treatment but police forcibly took him to hospital following the advice of doctors. The doctors warned if he would not be admitted to hospital, he would go into a state of unconsciousness. And that's all from me, so keep watching your favourite channel, the Sangat's channel, Sangat Television. Good night.